that's on me. He Well, he didn't think he was going to take off like that, but I did. I always had the faith in him. I always pushed him, you know, don't give up. Just keep going or whatever the case may be. And when I would hear it, and I'd be like, oh, that's a good one. That's on me, got him to where I'm at. It really just impact, like, I know, like, for a fact, like, you get one hit, you'll be on the road for about two years straight. He did the mixtape. Um, he called me, he's like, yo, I'm gonna come up there and I wanna, I wanna play the mixtape for you, and I wanna play it live on the radio. So, um, he did that, and he was like, this that motherfucker right here, that motherfucker, that motherfucker, hey, fuck, fuck that motherfucker right there. So, you know me, yeah, nigga, everybody fuck with everything, you know what I'm saying? Cause you know I hear it all the time, but then all of a sudden, I felt the wave. I started seeing that shit all on Snapchat. I started seeing that shit pop up. I was like, damn. Shit might be, motherfucker might be fucking with that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Like, we did it, we did it like we do, like we was doing every video at that time. We do a scene a day. It probably took us four weeks to shoot the video because we was doing a scene, one scene every week. So we were just coming up when we think of something. We'll shoot that scene. That's why you see every scene he got on different outfits and stuff like that because it was all different days. Well, it took like three, four months to get a million views, but then right after it hit a million, it just started jumping like three million, five million, just started jumping up. Shit, it's at like 150 right now. It might be the biggest song to ever come out of Dallas. Anthem, um, timing is everything. And, and when it dropped, I knew at that point it was a wrap, like, meaning he's out of here. You know, it was one of those things where, you know, when I got my personal friends like the DJ Clues, the DJ Selfs calling me like, yo, send me the That's On Me record. I ain't got it yet. Oh, I ain't got the clean version for radio yet and I want to play it. I knew it was out of there. Just out that song, I made M's off that thing. Like, it really, like, people started knowing who I was. They was taking into who I am. They seeing, seeing the shag cut, knowing that I ain't from there. That's why I purposely kept the shag cut, because I want y'all to know we from there. It's like, we ain't from nowhere else. It just really just put me like in another position to where I ain't gotta go back to the streets or I ain't just gotta worry about nothing no more. That's on me. He, he told me, like, yo, that's that motherfucker. Got out the sun on me. That's on me, baby. That's on me, baby. That's on me, baby.